Ezra Miller is still contracted by Warner to play a superhero on the big screen, but in real life, they just pled guilty. And how this begins was Ezra Miller's arrest in Vermont for burglary for stealing several bottles of vodka from their neighbor. And Vermont doesn't look kindly on that where it was reported Ezra Miller was looking at a one-year prison sentence. But Ezra Miller decided to plead guilty and because of that was only given a 90-day suspended sentence. And on top of that, a one-year probation, meaning if Ezra Miller breaks the law in Vermont for the next year, they have to go to jail for 90 days, no question. And this was only one legal issue Ezra Miller was having where they were arrested four times in the state of Hawaii and had the cops called on them 15 times. And in all four of those arrests, Ezra Miller had some sort of violence against women. And then Ezra Miller made their only defense being that the cops were transphobic. And Ezra Miller also has grooming accusations from the parents of activist Dakota Iron Eyes. But despite all this, Warner Brothers hasn't fired Ezra Miller from The Flash and said they still might rehire them again. Which has frustrated Henry Cavill fans because he was fired one month ago as Superman, but Ezra Miller still is employed. And Warner Brothers even brought Ezra Miller in for reshoots, saying they're very happy with Ezra Miller's mental status. That'll change because this is the first of many guilty verdicts, with that I'm Charles Peralta, hope you learned something.